Yes, this is Jim Morrison with Fenton Newspapers, and I'm here with Christopher Fleming uh, with his uh, entry. Uh, he's got it on display in the uh, club booth, with the, which is uh, the uh, Bruce Boosters. Uh, Christopher, tell me about your exhibit, how long you've been in 4-H, and... So I've been in 4-H four years now, and I've always liked barns. I used, I used to draw them a lot, so I thought I'd make a barn out of shotgun shells. Well, yesterday that imploded, and so we made one out of a machine shed out of wood for my John Deere tractors, the big farm John Deere tractors. Yes. So, what all's involved? What all's included in your display? So I have a couple, two bifolding doors, so I can get a large grain wagon in. The roof um, hinges over. We have a tool bench over here in the corner, and a hayloft. And then we have the big farm truck with a gooseneck hinge. Hinge, gooseneck. So you can hook this trailer up. You can move the skid loader and the skid loader's uh, attachments. So how did you come out with the judges? I got a blue ribbon. Is that good? Yeah. Um, I was not expecting to get this high because uh, being it was just on yesterday, we didn't have time to finish, put a finish on it. But it is sanded so that we could put a finish on it. Besides, there's a lot of barns out there that you see that kind of are kind of unfinished anyway, aren't there? Yes, there is quite a few. Now you live on a farm? Yeah. And uh, you got chores you have to do, or? Yes. So this works in around the chores. Yeah. Cool. Where do you go to school at? What? Where do you go to school at? Uh, I go to school at the uh, middle school here in Benton, Benton Shelf Park Middle School. Okay, Christopher, I appreciate it very much. Thank you. Thank you.